Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. I hope you guys are having an awesome Friday. I guess for you guys it's Saturday, but I hope you had an awesome Friday yesterday. Good morning. So we are just getting ready to go out. We have super fun things planned today. Do we have super fun things planned? Yes, and I want my mom. I want my mom to build my puzzle. Long time. So basically, the girls made a horsey puzzles at horse camp this week, so we're gonna, she, she wants me to do it. So over here I got my horse loving puzzle making girl, and over here I got my teenager almost nail polishing girl. I had more nail polish in like last year. Yeah, like in years, but now she needs to wear it. We're like getting ready to go, and all of a sudden she's like, ah! I haven't got my nail polish on, huh? No. <laughs> no. I got it. Anyway, she got that nail polish from a sub, and you love it, right? Yeah. Okay, just on to the puzzle. Let on me to the puzzle. The All right, so these are the pieces. Let's see if I can do it. I don't know if you guys know, but I'm not good at puzzles. Oh my goodness. This is a lot harder than you think. Um. <laughs> It's uh, a horseshoe, Mom. Okay, blue sky. Oh, it's a horseshoe. Aha! I got a piece. And then this. Uh, I don't know. Did Dad do this puzzle? Yeah. I'm terrible at puzzles. I need, like, the box picture. Uh, that is the box picture. Okay. What the heck? Okay. It's so easy. I don't know. I'm oh, oh, oh. Okay, want me to? Yeah, you're gonna have to do it. No, I think it, these are the bottom. Oh, she makes it look so much easier. And these are the bottom. A nice puzzle. It looks gorgeous. That's a little tiny horseshoe. High five, that is a little tiny horseshoe. Like I said, uh, puzzles are not my thing. I am not good at them. All right, it's guys. so easy. Dad got it. Yeah, I'm well, not good. All right, let's head out. We are headed to the mall, and Sam was just telling me that somebody commented and said, wow, you guys must be rock stars. How do you drive in the snow? And what did you say? I said it's called snow tires. We have to put them on in November. <laughs> yeah, in Canada, we have snow tires. They have better traction for the snow, so it's just the same. I have to be a little more careful, but it's pretty much the same. Anyway, I wanted to tell you guys that Sam and I have been talking a little bit about how we portray ourselves on our videos, how um, we show a lot of stuff that's not perfect, like at our barn and with our bunnies and the stuff that maybe we shouldn't show because it's negative or because it's not the way it should be and a lot of people get upset. It's really important to me to be able to show that we are vulnerable as people, that we don't know everything and that, and that it's okay to be a beginner, it's okay to not know everything and still be having a really fabulous experience. Do you think that's him? Yep. Yeah, like we could just show all the good stuff, all the happy stuff, and we are tempted to do that, but I want, I think it's important for all the people that are in our exact position, that are struggling because they feel like everybody knows more than them. I want, I think everybody should know that it's okay to be vulnerable. It's okay not to be perfect. It's okay to be learning. And I think it's also okay to share the things that you love. There's a lot of controversy over our barn not being the best barn and us being really proud of it. We're proud of our barn because of the things that are amazing about it, not because of the things that aren't amazing about it. And I think it's important to show that too, that even when things aren't perfect, there's always a silver lining and there's always, ooh, something almost crashed us. And there's always something to look forward to and to, and to think about. And if I brag about things that, that other people think aren't awesome and not brag worthy, I think it's important to know that from where we are right now, this is what's important to us. And I think that that's what our vlog is about. Our vlog is about being who you are. God has a plan for everybody and this is where we are right now in this moment and I don't want to waste a single second wishing that I was someplace different, knowing more, a perfect rider, a better a better person. I just want to appreciate all that I have going on right now, all that I'm learning right now and I want you guys to know that it is totally okay to be you.
Oh my gosh, you guys. We just found out, you guys remember when we rehomed our baby crow to a rescue facility that had a huge facility that specialized in birds and rescue animals? Their barn is on fire and it's out of control. The whole barn has been destroyed and it's spreading to their house. I'm just devastated for them because they are a, are a huge rescue center. If they're gone, I don't know what will happen for our community. And I just really hope that Bailey's safe and that all the animals got out of the barn. So if you guys pray, pray for them, please. I, I just got more information on the barn fire. It says that OSPCA is on scene helping with the animals, but it's still unclear if it, animals got out of the barn. All right, so we are at the mall. Where are we headed? I'm gonna have a shopping spree at Claire's. Ooh, I want this. You want that? You're picking stuff already? Mm -hmm. okay. Strawberries. So the girls got gift certificates for Christmas um, for Claire's, and so they're shopping. <laughs> You see anything you like? You kind of grew out of Claire's, huh? Yeah. My bunny can sit on it as well. Your, your, yeah, your bunny can sit on this and its tail will go through there, but it's it's too small. What is that? Oh, look. That's not the right kind. Look at this. This is cool. What is this, Mom? An iPad case? I don't know what that is. That's weird. Look, there's another one. It's a cell phone chair, probably. My guess. What about glasses? You guys love glasses. Look at these unicorn makeup brushes. They're cool. So, are you happy? Are you happy with all the things you got? Yeah, but I don't eat these. Yeah, you love candy, huh? The rule is no candy, right? That's my choice. We're at the barn, you guys. And it's the coolest day of the year. I know I complained about the cold before. It's cold. It is whew, colder than minus 40. It's freezing cold. We're ready to do it all. We're gonna do everything tonight. We're even gonna to get to do grain. We've never done grain before. Get up there. Guys, they're ready to come in.
we are going to end today's video, but before we do, we're gonna do comment of the day because I'm afraid my phone is gonna lose it on me. So, comment of the day goes to Sorrel Dreams, and she says, if Sabrina isn't stopping when you pull on the reins, then try turning her head all the way to your leg. That's disrespectful when she ignores you, so make her listen or else she will learn bad habits. Just a suggestion. Ginger, my horse, and Sabrina seem a lot alike, and I have to do this with Ginger when she ignores me sometimes. Those stubborn chestnut mares, haha. -ha. I've also seen improvement in Ginger's overall obedience by doing this. And thank you so much for the suggestion. We are gonna try that because we all have trouble with it. Gabby, what do they do at our barn? Run them into the wall. Yeah, so at our barn what they do is they run her into the wall. Does it work but, for you? Mm-hmm. Stopped? Yeah. So stop because you there's nowhere to go. Yeah, but I think it's a good thing to try turning her head all the way. I've been watching videos and kind of getting a feel for that kind of stuff, so I'm going to try it. I'm going to do tight circles. You're going to do tight circles? Yeah. Okay, so before we end today's video, do you guys remember when we first got Ruby and we loved her so much and we all fought over her because we just wanted her to love us? And we did, we played this game. We're going to do it right now. So we'll see how different it is. Watch this. Ruby! Come, come on, on, Ruby! Come on, come on Ruby. Ruby! Come on, come on Ruby! Yeah. Call her. Keep, just wait, let her run to check it out, Sophie. Sophie! <laughs> <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> she made herself at home here. Okay, don't pet her. Ruby! Ruby! Come on, Ruby! Ruby! Come on, Ruby! Okay, wait, let me go to Sophie's room and try. One, two, three. Come on! No touching. Come on. Come on, Ruby. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh, Ruby. So when we first played that game, when we first got her, she just kept running back and forth, back and forth. Now we can clearly see who her favorite is. That is it for today, guys. Me. Tomorrow. It's still me. Tomorrow we have our attack. Sabrina's tack haul. I don't know what you want to call it. Tomorrow we are going to show you every single thing that we have acquired for Sabrina since we got her and we've only had her for four months and we have a lot of stuff. So we're excited to show you guys. Catch you in the next video. Bye. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.